Okay, dear students, okay, by now I hope that you have watched the first two videos. Okay, now we are going on to the third video. Okay, and uh, what is the third video on? Okay, the third, this third video is actually on power. Okay, so what is power? Okay, power is uh, defined as the rate of doing work. Well, it sounds like a very complicated concept. Okay, but it's not really a complicated one. Okay, so what do we mean by rate of doing work? Okay, power is actually given by the formula. Energy divided by time. Okay, so power has a very um, special unit and it's called the Watt. Symbol is W. Energy, we know in our previous um, videos that energy is actually the, uh, given by the the SI unit or joules and time as usual time is given by the unit seconds okay so um, power just means uh, to, to put it in a very uh, simple sense okay power just means how how fast you can do uh, or how much energy do you spend in a, a certain amount of time Okay, so uh, let's put it into practice very quickly. Okay, um, let's use an example to help you. Okay, um, a ball is raised up to a height. in four seconds it had gained um, 20 joules of GPE in the process what is power used to raise the ball okay very simple question okay, we're going to try it now okay for those who are done you realize that the formula by using the formula power is equal to energy divided by time okay we will just substitute 20 divided by 4 seconds okay this will give us 5.0 watts is that straightforward okay so for those who uh, find the memorizing of this formula difficult okay some of you might prefer this triangle okay and uh, you can remember it as pet 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 okay uh, so of course the uh, N level and O level questions are rarely this simple. Okay, usually it's a little bit more complicated because it will require you to um, find the energy first before using it to calculate. Okay, so I'm going to give you another example that looks more like what you'll be uh, doing. Okay, and this is the example. Okay, a box of weight. 3 newtons is raised up a height of 4 meters by a boy in 5 seconds.
what is the power that was used by the boy to lift up the box. Okay, so um, for those who are ready, would you like to try this question on your own? And pause here. Okay, for those who are done, um, let's check your answer. Okay, so if you look at this question, you realize that this question has um, almost no information about energy, but they require you to find power. Okay, and we know that the formula for power is actually energy divided by time. So where do I actually get the information about energy? Now, if you look carefully, at this portion okay a box of weight 3 newtons is raised up a height of 4 meters okay so look at this look at this diagram very very carefully does this diagram look like something that you have learned before that's right. Okay, if you remember, okay, this diagram looks like work done. Okay, so from this diagram, we know that the box requires a work of 12 joules to lift up. Okay, the height of 4 meters. Okay, so because the force is actually parallel to the height. Okay, the weight here, 3 newtons is parallel to the height 4 meters. So since they are parallel, I know that the work formula, work done formula can be used, which is force times distance. So 3 times 4 is 12. Okay, and from this I know that 12 joules of energy 12 joules of energy is actually being spent which means that i have already found what's my energy and time is already given in the question five seconds so power is actually equals to energy divided by time and that would mean this 12 divided by five and this will give me the answer in watts Okay, so this question is not really that difficult. Okay, you just need to figure out what is the energy. Okay, what is the energy that we are talking about? So you realize that energy doesn't just mean the, the uh, gravitational potential energy or the kinetic energy. In fact, work is also a type of energy, which means I can also apply it over here. Okay, so uh, with this, okay, we have uh, ended the chapter on power. Okay, I hope this video is useful for you. Okay, um, so uh, do go and practice more okay, of the questions so that you are more familiar. Okay, and I hope that um, you do well. Okay, thank you students.